Hey, Sandy Levesque here doing something new with money every day for a whole year. In this episode, I'm going to walk you through doing a dream line from this book. It's uh, The 4 Hour Work Week by Tim Ferriss. This is part two. If you haven't already seen part one, go and watch that now. That will explain why I'm doing this and why this is such an amazing thing to do. Really quickly, a dream line is a way of making sure that you're not putting off loads of stuff that would really excite you and that you'd really love to do just to make sure that you're not putting it off until you're you know like 70 or 65 <laughs> because how many times do you think oh I'd love to go and visit the pyramids or I'd love to learn how to snorkel or to, to go deep sea diving and that stuff you watch it on TV you read about it on the internet but you never actually do it I remember I lived in Canada for a year and because I was in a new country I was really up for exploring. I did something new every single weekend, almost every weekend. I would go uh, kayaking, I went uh, quad biking, hunting, snow fishing, ice climbing, snowboarding, skiing, all this new stuff. And what I've realized is that when I'm back in my own country, in France, I don't do nearly as much of that stuff because I'm more like in an everyday routine. And does that ring any bells for you? You know, why live like that? Why not do more of the stuff that would really excite you on a regular basis? And that's what this exercise is all about, is bringing it into reality. So, in this episode, I'm finding out how much the stuff I'd like to do would cost. So I'm costing it. So I'm going to do it now, and then I'll, I'll show you how I did it, okay? Yes, I just finished costing my dream line, my dream lifestyle. And like Tim said, it's actually way less than I thought. So for my six month dream line, you know, if I said to you that I'd like to live in a beautiful place with a garden or a roof garden, I'd like to have my business, a large part of it outsourced, I'd like to have a new camera, I'd like to have a baby grand piano and weekly massages, you might be thinking that would be thousands and thousands of thousands of dollars extra but it's actually a grand a hundred and eighteen dollars extra a day which really isn't that much it's three thousand five hundred and eighty dollars a month to do more of the things I'd like to do so that's that's really made it way more feasible because it's not this massive you know 50 million <laughs> uh, number it's it's quite a manageable number and if I do it for 12 months then then it it jumps up but I have other things in here like within the next 12 months I am going to clear all my student debt I'd like to go visit a volcano I'd like to go sea kayaking in Norway I'd like to go to, on a meditation retreat to become a better skier in the winter. I'd like to live somewhere that has its own swimming pool, have some nice jewelry, have an investment account. Uh, and so all these things, when you break it down into a daily income and the worksheet, which if you click on the link below this video, you'll get access to that. The worksheet helps you to work it out. All you have to do is work out the price, do some research on the internet, and then it, it does it all automatically, it's in Excel, it's really easy to use, even if, like me, you're not a big Excel fan. And uh, so yeah, that's just made it way more actionable, because now I've got actual figures. And then what you do is you add in your, your current expenses and you trim them down as much as you can. Because the point here is to be, to be really quite flexible, you know, if you want to go and live in Paraguay for a month, then you, you've you got to find a way to, to style your life so you can do that not just wait until you've got two weeks holiday in August <laughs> so um, so then you, you add in your current expenses and it gives you a like an overall budget or a spending plan is what some people prefer to call that so there you go that was part two costing the dream lifestyle and realizing that it costs way less than you think it does which makes it way more possible which also means that you're way more likely to do it. Yes! <laughs> okay, so click on the link below this video to read the blog and get access to the resources to do this. And uh, stay tuned for tomorrow for part three. 
in which I will be working out the first step I can take to put all of this into place. Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow.